Hi guys and welcome back to my craft cave. I know it's been a long time, right? Yeah, I know. I've missed you guys. You've missed me too. That's great. Well, um, yeah, like all of you, I have a very busy life and, and many, many things vying for my attention. But today I was uh, feeling a little stressed out and decided that I was going to come back here and just relax. Take a few minutes of my busy schedule just to enjoy my life and part of that means I'm in the craft cave baby Batman had a cave I got a cave so what I'm doing um, I have rejoined Robin Carden's team as a Stampin' Up! demonstrator again and um, I decided I would use some of my Stampin' Up! product to make a card but now listen I'm a firm believer and use what you have. If you do not have these stamps or these inks or these uh, papers or, or whatever, just grab your papers and do it. You hear me? Do it. Grab your papers, all right? Okay, so the first thing I'm going to do to get started is I'm going to take Ranger's Archival Ink. Oh, I got a battery low warning. And I am going to use Banner Blessings. And I am using um, Shine like stars in the universe. And so the first thing I'm going to do is ink up my, pat, my, my um, stamp. And I am going to lay it down and stamp it off. I'm going to give it some good firm pressure like that pull it up. I like it. That looks good. I'll take it. Now the next thing that I plan to do is using my distress markers by Tim Holtz who says store these markers horizontally. I am going to get a pretty pretty blue. Maybe I don't know a salty ocean. What do you think guys? Or should I go with peacock feathers? I like peacock feathers. Let's try peacock feathers, okay? And so the first thing I want to do with the peacock feathers is just kind of give us a dark line here to indicate where the shadows would be because where the shadow is should be darker. All right, okay. And again over here, by the way guys, I am not a colorer, so if you think I'm trying to give lessons, you are wrong. I am not a colorer. I just, you know, enjoy what I do. So, and one of my favorite things to say is if you wanted it perfect, you could buy it at the store. So there you go. I don't think any of you really want it perfect. You just want to enjoy what you're doing. All right. So then you color, 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 color. All right. And then you color here too. Woo, woo, woo. It doesn't have to be perfect. Shine like the stars in the universe. Woo, 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 woo. And I think I'll get uh, dusty cut now. I don't want dusty concord. I want something pinkish looking. Let's get pink. Let's grab picked raspberry, darling. Picked raspberry. That's what we're going to get. And we're going to put that on the berry bag. We're going to do the pretty little lines. We're going to color in the lines today, class. Nobody should be going outside of the box. Do you remember your teacher saying that? Mm, never worked. I still colored outside the lines. I was a rebel that way. Yeah. I did it my way. I did it my way. Oh, sorry about that. Didn't mean to go there. Well, Elvis moment. I guess. I don't know. Okay, so there we go. Now, the next thing that I want to do is to take these lovely, lovely tools that my sister gave to me. She bought them for me. Isn't she an awesome sister? Don't you just love sisters like that? Don't you wish you had one? These are called Perfect Layers. If you have not seen Perfect Layers demonstrated, please look this up on YouTube. Because this is an amazing set of tools, and what is so great about them, they are made for right-handers and left-handers. You heard me right, folks. 
This is for either person or even for those who are ambidextrous. But if you're working on the left, when you lay it down, you'll be looking at the numbers like this. But if you're working on the right, you just spin it around. And there's your number on the other side. Is that not genius? I don't know who thought that process up, but you are genius. All right. So anyway, you, the way, no, I'm not showing you that. Google this. Go YouTube this, okay? So anyway, blah, 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 blah. By the miracle of YouTube, I have this gorgeous orange, a friend loves at all times, Proverbs 17, 17. And what I'm going to do after that is I'm going to grab these handy dandy boxed card set that I got from Hobby Lobby 1,400 million years ago, I think. And I want to find something that will look kind of cute. Oh, I like that. I like that. What y'all think? What y'all think? Hmm? I think that's cute. I think that's cute. And so I'm going to take that. And I am going to pop dot that up. Or dimensional that up. Or in your world, whatever you call it, you're going to put it up. Because it's always neat to have dimension. Oh, look, they're dimensionals, y'all. I have some actual true-to-life dimensionals, which, by the way, you can order for the low, low price of blah, 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 from Stampin' Up. So here we go. I'm going to flip this over, and I'm going to put a dimensional there, and a dimensional there, and a dimensional there, and a dimensional there. And we're going to pull off these little gloober backs like that, whatever you want to call them. The little plastic adhesive sheet thingamajig. Woo! Get off of there. There's always one that wants to be obstinate, for goodness sake. All right. Now, I am going to put this down right here. Oh, I like that. That's kind of cute. Now, I want to show you something very impressive i am frugal i am cheap i'm not frugal i'm cheap okay look at these i picked these up at the dollar tree y'all you hear me dollar tree a buck a pack can you believe it look they're gorgeous and i don't know if chinese are telling the truth or not but they say they're handmade so why not put them on my handmade card just saying what do you think? All right, so let me see. I had an open pack of these somewhere. I don't know what I did with them. I really don't want to open another one, but I may have to because the open pack. Oh, there they are. Never mind. I found them. And they're a cute orange color. Look at there. How pretty are those? And I do think they'll be just adorbs on my little card here. I'm going to put one in this corner. Look how cute that is. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Look how sweet. And I'm going to put one in this corner. And right there. Get your little tentacles underneath there, baby. Go on. Get under. There you go. All right. And there it is. Look how quick we did that. What did that take? Five, ten minutes? I don't know. Who knows? But the point is, I had a really good time making it, and I got to talk to my friends. So, get your stuff. Go sit in your little area of the world and be happy today. Make a joyful noise. I do it all the time. People think I'm crazy, but it's okay. I don't mind. And then you can send a card to a friend. All right, guys. I love you with all my heart. I hope you're having a blessed day today. I'll talk to you later. Bye now.